Hi y'all, this is Maddie from Maddie's Kitchen, and today I'm gonna make you all some Seattle hot dogs. And I might also throw some chili hot dogs in here too. But what I'll be using, I'll be using some ballpark, uh, you know, bun-sized beef uh, hot dogs. And also I'll be using some bacon. And when you're using bacon, I'll be wrapping my hot dogs with bacon. I'll make sure you use a thin bacon, because normally I use thick, but I'm using thin for this. A uh, hot dog, and I also have some bun size uh, bread, and this is ha sweet Hawaiian. I've never tried this before, but I know that's gonna be good. Pepper Ridge form. Okay, I also have two things of Philadelphia cream cheese, and I have the, the orig original, and I also have the uh, the one with the chives and onions. I have that, and I'll be using uh, this mustard, uh, garlic, pepper, salt. And these are sliced, two types of onions. They're sweet onions and they're uh, white onions are sliced. Also, I have two types chopped and it's sweet and it's white. And here's my butter and my oil. And these are things that I'll be using. Okay, this is, I'm back with y'all. I wrapped some of this bacon off camera. All you gotta do is, if it's thick, you know, that's why you get the cheap thin bacon because this is kind of, some of it's thick. Most of the ones I wrapped before wasn't that thick. And when you're cooking it, yeah, make sure it's thick together. See, I got these already wrapped. Put these in here. I'm cooking a lot of them because I love this one. Somebody might come in and want some of them. I'm cooking them. These are bun size uh, hot dogs. And I hope you all looked at my other video, the one that I did. I showed the uh, uh, snacks for the Super Bowl. And I then cooking the thing. I just did a presentation. And if you uh, look on my uh, YouTube, all those things that I did, the, uh, the tuna, I think it was tuna, chicken, and uh, seafood salad, all those show on my channel. I did all of those on my channel. So I'm going to wrap this bacon right here. See, it's a little too thick. I mean, no, it's thin. No, when you're wrapping them, make sure that they are not, that the bacon is not thick. And when you're cooking it, I'm gonna put this in the oven. I have my oven uh, heated to 400, and I'm gonna let it cook on one side. Once it cook on one side, I'm gonna cook it on the other. While these are cooking, I'm gonna get my um, my uh, onions together, saute my onion. So this good old rest. This is, if you've never eaten it before, you see how many hot dogs I'm putting in here, because <laughs> I love them. I'm gonna put this one here. And I, most people do. This is called a Seattle. I looked at when I looked in uh, YouTube, they got all kinds of uh, hot dogs name, and most of them are named after state. You know, they got Chicago. They got everyone else. I couldn't believe all those types of hot dogs. But all of, all of them, I like this one the best. This is my favorite one. So I'm gonna set these in the oven, and I'm gonna set the oven. Uh, Back to them, okay. I'm gonna check on them. I'm gonna let them brown on one side, the bacon, and like I say, spread them out a little bit because you want that bacon to cook. And I'm gonna turn them over after they cook here. That's in the stove. Okay, then. Yeah, I'm back with y'all. I set the hot dogs. Remember, I wrapped the hot dogs in bacon. I left a few without bacon, and they bun size. And what I'm getting ready to do now is I'm gonna add some oil, you know, any type of oil you want. I'm a vegetable oil, olive oil. I like that taste better, but that's up to you. And I'm gonna take these, I'm gonna let this get a little warm. I don't have to, because I'm gonna let these onions, like I told you, I had two types of onions. I had the, the sweet ones and I had the white ones. And so I'm gonna put these in here. I'm gonna let all these, um, let all of them uh, uh, sa uh, saute a little bit, because that's gonna be it. I might leave a few of them in here for if somebody wants fresh ones, you know, sliced fresh ones. I might leave a few in here for that. So, okay. Might enough for if somebody wants some. And I also, uh, grab the stove. I let these cook a little bit. I cut the stove down some. I don't want them to cook those. And after these cook just a little bit, I'm gonna put some butter in here so, so the butter won't burn. And that'll be a good taste, y'all. Uh, Cut it down low because you don't want, you want these to look good and not burn. I'm going to cut it down. I'm going to put a little butter in here now. Let the butter melt. Let's see, butter will burn quicker than grease in there. 
when you add the butter and the oil together, it gets under a very good taste. So let this cook. Let me check on my buns. Let me check on my hot dogs for a second. See how they doing while that's cooking. Here they are. Let me get a brook towel so I can pull them out so you can see them. Now I might have to take this out of cooking. Doing pretty good. Be careful. See how they doing? I'm going to let them turn down once without the bacon cooking a little faster. But once these brown on this side, I'm going to turn them over. Okay. I got to put that, adjust this oven. Okay, get back with you. Okay, then I'm going to I'm going to take a little of this butter out. I think I'll take a little of this butter out if I can get it. I don't want that much butter in here. Check it out. But what I'm getting ready now, so what I need, this, the stove is low. You don't want them to burn. You just want them to count. Whatever that word that he said. So I'm going to put a little pepper in here, just a little pepper, to season my onion so they can taste good with the butter and the oil. Put a little pepper in them. Just a little bit. You know, you probably never seen it cooked this way. My son, he cooks his like this. So I said, that's a good idea. Put a little salt on these onions. And I'm going to put a little garlic powder. Garlic powder, not salt, garlic powder. Um, just a little bit. And I'm going to let these do their thing. Give them a good golden color. Cause these will be going on top of my hot dogs. Okay, I'll get back with you when they get through cooking. Okay, my hot dogs have come out the oven. Here's some that I put in. They're done. I put in without bacon. These are one with bacon. I kind of like both of them. And the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take me some cream cheese. I should have let yours make sure yours are put in these buns. I butter the buns. I'm gonna put some cream cheese in them. You know kind of hard so you know make sure yours come room temperature I'm not gonna do all of them like this but put some cream cheese in it Philadelphia this is Philadelphia cream cheese like I said mine's a little hard it's kind of hard to work with you can put it in the microwave for a second I could but I don't I'm not going to do that and it'll melt it up put a plenty of cream cheese in there plenty like I say I'm gonna get one of these ready for you with the cream cheese in there. My bread are burnt. I kind of toasted a little bit too much, but that's good. I'll eat the ones that toasted too much. And I'm gonna take one of these uh, hot dogs with the bacon wrapped around and put it in here. Oh, it's so good, honey. I season. You remember I season my uh, my uh, 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 vegetables. So, and I'm gonna take one and put this on it. One without it, one without, without the cream cheese. And what I'm gonna do with the cream cheese, I'm gonna just take and put some of these onions, this is it. Some of these grilled onions on there. I'm gonna use my hands clean so I can jug them in there right. You put some of the uh, onions in there, you call it a day. Sprinkle you some mustard on it, and that's how they do. That is so good, y'all with this onion and so now I'm gonna put a little mustard on top of this call it a day this I can put a little parsley on it that's it call that a day and now these right here I'm gonna put a little chili on this one I made some chili I had some leftover chili I'm gonna put a little chili on these right here and when you're using chili, the only thing I like on mine, now that's up to you to do yours like you want to. I take and put uh, uh, just mustard and some fre fresh onions on mine. Now here's my onions. I got some onions. These are yellow onions. I just sprinkle them on top of them, you know, just put a little bit on top of them. And some mustard. Now that's for chili. That's, a, that's, a, that's what people know. Ooh. Making a mess. That's what people normally do with their chili dog. They just use mustard, uh, fresh onions, and uh, just chili. Fresh onion, mustard, and chili. Okay, I'm going to do the rest of them and get back with you all. Thank you all for tuning in to my presentation. I hope you enjoyed my three types of hot dogs. The main ones was 
I was trying to show you all, introduce you all to the Seattle dog. Share this with friends and family. And once again, look at the presentation I did for my uh, Super Bowl things. I, I, like I said, I have all those on my channel. I just showed you some different setups that you all can enjoy. Like I said, once again, thank you for tuning in to Maddie's Kitchen and have a great day.